morning. Welcome back to This Week in the Mohawk Valley. Time now for our CNY Travel segment. Joined in studio, as always, by Kelly Blazowski from Oneida County Tourism. Good morning. Good morning, Jeff. Glad to be here. What What are you uh, What are you wearing on your feet this morning? Uh, um, well, I did have on a red part, a red sparkly pair of boots for some f- <laughs> photography last week, so that was fun, and that goes right along with the musical coming into town, Kinky Boots. And we have Derek Clark here from Broadway Utica. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks Thank you for joining. Oh, pleasure. Yeah, well, we're so excited to bring this uh, Cindy Lauper. I mean, everybody that's a fan of hers and the work that she does, uh, you know, and people just discovering, you know, from uh, her work behind the stage, you know, uh, because, you know, we all know her on the stage, um, but her brilliant work you know, that she does behind the scenes as well. So Most people don't uh, think of Cindy as a Broadway person. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, when you hear the soundtrack mm-hmm. to the Broadway production of Kinky Boots, you definitely hear Cindy Lauper coming yeah. through. Yeah. She does a, an amazing job with yeah. the lyrics and, and the music. Yeah. So we're here to talk about a couple of different aspects. You have a wonderful um, gala event that is going along with this production, and that'll be happening uh, on opening night. So let's talk about uh, that and how you're bene- uh, the benefactor, the Q Center. Uh, yes, we have a benefit that is scheduled for September 6th. Uh, it's the first night of the show. And uh, Kinky Boots has partnered with uh, Broadway Utica as well as with the Q Center, Mm -hmm. with the support of our our, uh, sponsors. Uh, We were able to make this event a really special night. Uh, The event will be a red carpet, Mm -hmm. uh, walk down Genesee Street on the red carpet. Uh, There'll be the step and repeat, the photos with uh, with the sponsor board. Uh, you'll see the show, which will start sharply at 7.30. Mm-hmm. After the show, if uh, you have given to the cause, uh, you will also attend a party at Ocean Blue mm-hmm. immediately following the show where the cast and the crew uh, are also going to be present for that event. That's exciting. And that yeah. all comes with a VIP ticket. That is correct. And, and those are still available. They are still available. Yeah. Uh, you can uh, get them by calling my office and speaking to me directly if you'd like at 724-7196. Mm-hmm. The VIP event tickets are not available online. You do have to call uh, right. and speak to someone in person to, to make your purchase. Uh, mm-hmm. And then uh, the other seats. It's not 100% VIP all that right, night. Right. Uh, there is a select group of seats, uh, mm-hmm. the best seats in the house that are mm-hmm. for the VIP event. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then we have the other seats available as well. There, are, yes, and th- those are at your, you know, your regular um, Broadway Utica pricing points. Yes, exactly. Mm-hmm. So right. you have the ticket price, and then what's above and beyond the ticket price is what will be considered a portion of the proceeds Mm -hmm. that will be given back to the Q Center, uh, which is a wonderful place here in Utica that a lot of people don't know about, uh, but it is a uh, safe haven for the LGBTQ youth in our community. Uh, It's a place where they can can go, feel supported, feel safe. Uh, Mm -hmm. There's people there for uh, that can help them with counseling issues. Uh, There's uh, you know they prepare them food if they need it. Mm -hmm. Uh, There's so many incredible things that this center does uh, for our youth in the community, Mm -hmm. and it's all the Mohawk Valley. It's not just Utica. And you would be surprised how many kids are in this center. they opened this center in January on Genesee Street, and uh, I was there with a, uh, a group of peers, uh, and there were 14, I think, of us that were sitting at the table, and it was pretty cramped quarters with 14 and people standing. Uh, they, the Q Center, uh, said that on any given night, there would be double plus what was in that room. Wow. And they help them with their homework. They tutor them. Great. Uh, they try yeah. to get, you know, they want them to feel included and, mm-hmm. and feel comfortable in their environment. So, mm-hmm. and we know that, you know, if, you know, we provide a safe space for, right. for the LGBTQ youth, mm-hmm. uh, that's just going to make 
more you know the Mm -hmm. streets a safer place as well absolutely and providing with them with the services and the networking resources um you know when obviously sometimes they don't know where to turn so it's wonderful yeah wonderful and interestingly enough is that uh what people don't know is that the q center receives zero funding from the state of new york so this benefits like this are very valuable to them very valuable we're Mm -hmm. hoping that we can give them a bigger space uh we can provide food and clothing and mm-hmm. all the necessities and you know my goal is to bring awareness to the Q Center and that it exists and that this issue is out there mm-hmm. you know we we need to protect the youth in the LGBTQ community they need a safe space to mm-hmm. go to mm-hmm. uh, if I can bring awareness and raise a little money at the same time then we've achieved two goals. Two goals, absolutely. And at the same time, bring Broadway to Utica, so to the stage. And Kinky Boots, a wonderful, wonderful celebration of life and love and uh, overcoming challenges as well. So very apropos. Perfect for, the message is perfect for what we're trying to accomplish here. Yeah, and so the show does start, as you said, at 7.30, um, curtain goes up, and um, it is uh, for the 6th, 7th, and eight. So if you can't participate on the six, you can certainly support the show and Broadway Utica and the Stanley Theater by, you know, making your way to get to the show for sure. Absolutely. I mean, having such a great show, this is a Broadway equity show. So this is probably the biggest uh, musical to ever hit Utica right. uh, since uh, we have been showing here. Uh, it's it's just I mean it's a huge honor to be able to host this show while they're here right and uh, it sells out every night on Broadway eight shows a week mm-hmm. and uh, we're very 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 lucky that they chose us for three shows yeah can, can I ask about the gala once again uh, you mentioned earlier in this event I'll call it a wraparound event but a supporting event um, a red carpet down Genesee Street uh, that's intriguing I don't think we've ever had that here before uh, tell, tell us about the party again and the red carpet where does it start where does it be uh, end well the red carpet is currently we're um, we're meeting today uh, so the uh, the red carpet is uh, planning my plan is for it to start at court in Genesee uh, you'll that's where everybody will assemble you'll be whisked down the red carpet. Mm-hmm. Uh, you will have your step and repeat along the way, which is where you have your all your photos taken as you mosey on down. And uh, you know, of course, the media is going to be there, so we'll have some media attention as well. You have the sponsor boards, uh, you know, with uh, Adirondack Bank, River Hill Property, and Leather uh, Stocking Abstract, and Ocean Blue, and. Uh, Utica, our Bank of Utica. Uh, so the, all of our great sponsors will be on the board. From there, you'll go into the theater. Uh, you'll take your seats. The show will start at 7.30. After the show, uh, everyone who was part of the gala will go to Ocean Blue. And we'll have some fun things in between as well for people sure. uh, uh, to entertain. So while the crowd is, that's participating in the gala is being whisked off to Ocean Blue, the cast will be coming off stage and uh They will go by bus uh, to Ocean Blue as well Mm -hmm. to speed up the process. We'll get them upstairs and positioned, and everybody will have a meet and greet with the cast. They'll get to mingle with them. We're going, I mean, Ocean Blue is going to put on a fabulous spread for us. Uh, So it will be a cocktail reception. So it's going to be very, very, a very nice evening, uh, very memorable. Uh, The Q Center will also be present, uh, so you'll be able to get information about the Q Center. Uh, You'll be able to mingle with some of the Q Center executives. Uh, And I think that most importantly here with this entire event was when um, I was trying to orchestrate this and really make, you know, partner with the Q Center, which they were just incredible to deal with. Uh, My only request was that 100% of the money stayed at the Utica Q Center. Mm-hmm. There are nine Q Centers uh, across central New York, uh, and I didn't want the money spread. It right. needed to stay here in our community. And that sure. was, and if they couldn't do that for me, then I wasn't interested in participating. Uh, and they agreed to it. They said, absolutely, we, we will do that. So That's all great. of this money stays right here in Utica. It's not going out of the community. Excellent. Excellent, yeah. to, to the show itself, I wanted to mention, uh, or ask, I should say, Kiki Boots, um, 
It is a family-friendly show. That's right. Yes, it's very family-friendly. Yes. Um, it has the word kinky in it, so, so people are like, going, oh, oh you know, maybe not. But. Yeah. Uh, uh, but, yeah, it's I've seen it, and uh, it, it is a wonderful show. It's all about, I mean, it's everything that you want to instill in your kids. Mm-hmm. You know, it's love and acceptance and tolerance mm-hmm. and, you know, accepting people for who they are not who you want them to be uh there's just so many great messages and uh and then you combine that with it being a musical Mm -hmm. with great music by cindy lauper Mm -hmm. uh and you listen to the words of the song i mean i i I encourage everyone just to go onto spotify and download the you know the soundtrack from the broadway version and you know listen to it a couple times and i guarantee you you will be singing the songs. You know, you'll be moving to it. We listened to my office uh, to the point where I think I drive my staff crazy because they're like, Can you just please turn it off? But it's, yeah. a great, it's great music. Yeah. And this, uh, you know, really leads into the rest of your season. You have a wonderful lineup uh, starting and, you know, we'll be going through the winter months and into early spring. So as you said, that's all set and in place now. Uh, tickets are available online. Um, yes. So, you know, everyone can uh, go to BroadwayUtica.com at any time to buy tickets for any of your shows that are coming up. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, we are still in s- subscription mode. Uh, we're, I will be turning subscriptions off as of September 19th. That'll be our last day to accept any new subscriptions. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then it'll just go straight single ticket sales from that point forward. Our season will begin with fame. Uh, and fame arrives. We have Kinky Booth leaving on the 8th. And fame arrives on the 11th. <laughs> and they're here for almost two weeks, Uh because they are teching here. It is a tech show. Yes, it's a tech show, so they'll be in the community. Mm -hmm. Um, We also, which I am going to put this out there, we also have kind of a local boy who was casted, uh, so I can't say who it is yet, but uh, he is local, and since he is from central New York area, uh, and I know that his family is terribly excited they've already yeah. contacted us and they're buying their tickets and uh, uh you know getting all prepared in their hotel rooms and all that for the show mm-hmm. uh and uh, he in has also called and bought tickets to the show as well and he's starring in it <laughs> so um you know which is is hysterical but um it's uh going to be a great show we go from fame uh we go right into uh, a christmas story mm-hmm. from a christmas story we'll take a break and we'll go into uh we'll have one night of rudolph in december which is of course for the family and for the kids uh a great show and uh then we have pippin and from pippin we go to rent from rent to dirty dancing uh just a wonderful so. lineup <laughs> This is, yeah, this is a record-breaking year for Broadway Utica. This is our biggest year in the history with the number of subscribers. Uh, Traditionally, subscription base is lost here. This is our first year pulling an increase over last year in subscriptions. That's great. uh, In both uh, ticket sales as Mm -hmm. well as dollars. Mm -hmm. And continuing the tech shows and, you know, to capture the eye and attention of directors and producers from New York City, you know, and all over as uh, eyes on Utica to to bring their show so that's such uh you know if people haven't read the articles or listened you know because we've talked about it from time to time on here it's such an economic impact for utica every time you manage to bring in a tech show so. absolutely uh, you know support utica mm-hmm. support the theater mm-hmm. you know uh kinky boots mm-hmm. you know having the equity version of kinky boots here huge for us uh again the tech shows uh mm-hmm. we have uh, two tech shows that are on the books now i have a third one that i'll be announcing in a couple of weeks it is so confirmed mm-hmm. uh so we'll, we'll have another one that'll be coming uh mm-hmm. between uh december and mid-january mm-hmm. uh so right in the middle of the winter months uh so and it's a big yeah. one yeah That's it's all. really putting utica on the map as you know the, the a cultural center um and you know investment in the arts and all of that so it's a wonderful wonderful kind of new uh paradigm for utica to be experiencing so <laughs> thank you for all your work that you do and your staff i know you've got a great team and yes. uh Get your tickets to Kinky Boots, and if you can, if you're available on the, on September 6th, support the gala as well, and I'm sure Derek can get you tickets. Your number again? 
7196 mm -hmm. or www.broadwayutica.com. For gala night tickets, call me directly. For any other shows or tickets, you can call the office or go online, whichever you mm -hmm. prefer. And stop into your office right yeah. on Genesee Stop Street. in, 258 Genesee Street. Right across from the stand. We have fun in there. <laughs> it's a fun office. <laughs> Thank and, you. And music, I've heard. And music. <laughs> Thank you, Derek. Thank you, Kelly. We'll take a quick time out and come back with more of This Week in the Mohawk Valley.